Welcome to the end of day seven. It was our first full day in New York and was a lot more challenging than we had anticipated. We started today very optimistic. After carefully reviewing our options on coinmap.org, we decided to start our day down in the Wall Street area and work our way up. Before departing, we took some time on Craigslist to see if we can convince someone to sell us some tickets for Bitcoin. Bob Dylan, Book and Mormon, and the New York Rangers were the tickets of the day. We contacted no less than 30 sellers and made our proposal, tickets in exchange for Bitcoin. Confident one of our requests would work out, we packed up and headed into the city. Our first stop, Bitcoin Central, down by Wall Street. To our understanding, the Bitcoin Center is the only brick and mortar place in the United States dedicated exclusively to promoting Bitcoin. Seemed like the ideal place to start. We confirmed operating hours online and headed over. And unfortunately, nobody was there. They were closed. We headed back to the car just around the corner and were welcomed by an NYPD traffic cop and a parking ticket for $130. Determined not to be defeated, we shook it off and headed to our next stop. Certainly, Mary Jane and Hemp Shop would be better. We called to confirm the location. There was no answer, but we went ahead anyways. We arrived at the address, and no Mary Jane. Two strikes against us, we still remained positive. We kept going. Our next stop was Gotham Cookies. And apparently Gotham Cookies does not exist either. The address we found on coinmap.org led us to a pizza place. And no, they didn't accept Bitcoin. At this point we were starving and losing faith. We found Helen's Pizza in Jersey City on coinmap.org, called, confirmed they were open, yes they accepted Bitcoin, so we headed over. And finally we had success. We ate our fill and even packed up some leftovers to bring back to the hotel. Heading back into Manhattan, we followed up on our Craigslist requests. No takers. A few people tried to convince us why we should just go get cash and come see them, but nobody would take our Bitcoin. Tired and full of pizza, we headed back to the hotel to reflect on our defeats and plan a better tomorrow. And now for the breakdown. Bitcoin spent today, 0.39, approximately 150 US. Mileage, 24 miles, about 40 kilometers. Our Bitcoin friend network grew by a factor of three and we received two more donations today. Thank you very much. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the YouTube channel, like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and join the conversation on Twitter.